All right, I'm testing out the Vortex Aero uh, Bluetooth transmitter receiver that's supposed to adapt to ICOM radios. Um, what I'm doing right now is I've got Pandora on an old phone of mine. I'm injecting into the speaker plus and minus, which would be the signal. Oh, let me show you up here. Speaker plus and minus, which would be the signal that comes out of the airband radio, and it's coming through to my Bluetooth. So you can hear it. All right, so that's working. And then um, here's a test of when I push. This is a test of the signal to push to talk on this on this uh, meter. It has impedance to ground uh, with one diode drop when I hit the remote push to talk button. Okay, next step is on the scope. I'm looking at the audio signal from the microphone. You can kind of see music going through. What I'll do is I'll hit the push to talk and then when I do and I'm talking into the microphone, we definitely get my voice. It's hard, hard to demonstrate here uh, while the music's playing, but that means that this guy is going full duplex. And if it's wired properly to the ICOM A14, we ought to also be able to get side tone feedback into our system. So there you have it. I, I, I think it's a nice little piece of electronics. It's just miswired um, in its present state from Vortex Aero. It, um, where did I put that connector? Anyway, they uh, had it wired to a four pin connection. Here it is. This is a four wire connector. And for the ICOM A14, it has to be a five wire connector. All right, hope that made sense to you. All right, bye.